is MTP Flyers here with my review of my next case. So what do you guys think? Do you like this case on here? Does it look good? Looks pretty nice on there. That Capsule Neo? Well guess what? It's not a Capsule Neo. This is the iGear USA Sleek Crystal Case. You guys know that I did the unboxing on this already. So most of you saw my video know that this was already the generic version, or I like to call it the economic version. Few differences in them. One is that it does not have the silicone that goes inside there, which we have here. And it does not have the plugs that go on the top and bottom. And I will get into that for you guys to show you why. But first and foremost, what's awesome about this case and why I called it the Economic Neo is the price. The Capsule Neo is going for about 30 bucks right now. The Crystal Case by iGear USA is going for $14.99. With that, you get the white strip on the back, which feels exactly like the Capsule Neo. Very few differences in those. You get the clear H frame, which just sits right on your phone. Some people were scared about it, touching the phone and making contact with it. I have had no problems. I've taken this thing off many times. There are no scratches whatsoever. If you're careful with it, you'll have no problems. Very decent coverage on the phone, just like the Capsule Neo. Covers up your bezel all the way around, just like I'm looking for. That's exactly why I wanted to try it out. The price, the look, without the silicone. I loved it. I had this on for a few days. Nobody could tell the difference. People that saw my case thought, hey, hey, you got that, you got that uh, bow tie look going on again. I was like, yeah, you know, you like it? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's that case. You had that on before. They don't know. Of course, you know, they're not into this as much as some of us are. That's the way it goes. And that's all you're looking to do is to have the same look for less price. A lot of people complained about the silicones, putting them on and taking them off. It says it takes too long. It's a great case, but I like to take my case off and clean it. I don't have time to be messing with the silicone. Well, this is perfect for you guys. You can do that. You can get the look, half the price, and you don't have to mess with the silicone. Saw it on there. You couldn't even tell the difference. These feel exactly the same as I said. The differences are the logo. This will not fit on this frame, and this will not fit on this frame. They are just a little bit different. The bottoms, the Capsule Neo is bigger on the port than the iGear USA. And one of the things that the iGear USA is not able to do is fit the plug. This plug is too big for the bottom of the piece here. And I'll show you that in a minute and what that does. So, real quick, you got your price, you got the look. You don't have to mess with the silicone if you're not into that. It's easy to put on. Slide it right on there. Pull it over the corner. It goes on real simple. That's it. You're not messing with your silicone. You got your top. You do your bottom the same way. I was always nervous about pulling this up over the silicone at the bottom. You don't have one now. It goes right on. The one thing I do want to let you guys know is that before you do put this on, you do want to make sure that your phone is clear because you do get things underneath that you will see that. But you'll do that with the silicone as well if the silicone's not not clean before you put it on. But there it is. You couldn't tell the difference in that if I don't have the Switch Easy Cover logo on there. That's about it. Other than that, it looks exactly the same. You don't have your silicone on, so your rocker button and your silencer are not covered. Same thing with your sleep button slash power button. The plugs will not fit in there because they are not designed to do that. It is a little bit smaller. And if you do take the plug and slide it on there, you will see that it sticks up. If you push it on, notice that your bottom bows up and it will close back up and push it out. See that? So that's it. That's why that will not work. But that's okay. Yes, it to bum me out a little bit, but it's no big deal. I got the look that I'm going for at half the price. A lot of people say, hey, 30 bucks for a case is kind of expensive. I'm going to look for something less expensive. You don't get that look. 
Well, now you do. It's awesome. The one thing I did want to let you guys know is there is no problem with plugging this in to the port either with your iPod plug. Plugs in just fine. I charge it with the case on there. No issues whatsoever. Now, any of the other docks or anything that it goes in there, I did not try because I don't have a dock radio or anything like that. So that might be an iffy question on that just for the simple larger opening on the bottom of that frame as opposed to this one. But I don't have any problems charging it. It clicks in there. It locks in there without an issue. There are no problems whatsoever. So, guys, that's it for my review on the iGear USA Sleek Crystal Case. I definitely urge you guys to go out and try this if you're looking for a less expensive case. I don't think you will be un unhappy with it. I think you'll be extremely happy. You've paid half the price. You could get the white and the black two cases and you get them for the same price you buy for one of the Capsule Neo. So that's it. I just wanted to let you guys know my review on that. This case is great. I'm going to leave it on here for another couple days. I do have lots of stuff coming up. Something going on with the Switch Easy Rebels. The spines that I got, the purple and the orange, and I do have to go back and I'm going to do my official review and do the swap outs with the spines as well. You guys had a lot, lots of questions on what colors you wanted to see. I'm going to do that. That'll be coming up in the next day or so. This is MTP Flyer signing out. You guys have a good evening. See you.